We're on peak mommy Yang time, everyone. I never thought I'd see this Yang ever again. She's sassy, sexy, and insanely strong in this. See, it's always been Yang's attitude and combat prowess that made her such a competent fighter for her age. Yang was never arrogant. She was confident, and whenever she fought, that confidence radiated throughout the entire fight, making her opponent second-guess themselves and eventually feel too small to do anything. It's a version of Ying that we really only see in the early days of Beacon and in the Ruby mangas, so it was really refreshing to see Ying as this playful, confident monster on the field. Don't get me wrong, Yang has had some great moments in Volume 7, but this just brings me back. Even when she isn't fighting, I just love how carefree she is. When she's approached by the man, she's put off at first, but then realizes that she can tolerate them and punish him for not realizing just who he's talking to. And of course, Yang always has to have her fun. She played such a convincing role that I almost fell for her act. If Yang slid her finger across my chest and then goes in for a kiss, yeah, I'm falling for it too. I'm sorry. You would too though, don't lie. And let's be honest here, I'd rather have my head violently slammed on a wooden bar than have my future children violently crushed. Junior got it so tough, man. Anyways, the sheer amount of disrespect that Yang did to this man. Imagine hitting on a girl, getting a massive concussion, trips you, pours her drink on you, makes the face of a demon. Look at that face off. She's enjoying herself. Congrats. And then she just beats the lights out of you? Yeah, no, wrap it up. I can only take so much. I'm sorry, Yang was just on a whole different time during the night of Junior's club. She really came in there, assaulted the owner, whooped his henchman, beat the DJ, and then blew up the club? And then she had the nerve to come back like it was no big deal and tell the owner that he owed her a drink. Beacon Arking was just built different, y'all. Now I have to talk about these fighting scenes. Oh my god, I miss Yang's hand-to-hand -hand combat. Notice how the entire time she's fighting in the bar, she isn't taking her eyes off of him. She's constantly watching him in his hands and directs the flow of combat. I love this. It really keeps the focus on our characters and makes it feel like we're actually in the fight. The Yang v Adam fight was great, and I've been enjoying the new additions to Yang's weapons, but I just enjoy seeing her raw hand-to-hand -hand combat, y'all. Now. Ladies and gentlemen, let me paint a picture for y'all. You just got whooped by the girl you were hitting on, smashed through a window, and then you transform into your final form. And she just straight up looks at you and asks, hey, have you seen this person? She does not care about you turning into a bear. Yang is literally built different. Now, this bear transformation was actually done really well. Just seeing him transform and gain the traits of a bear, and then the shot of this big black silhouette just towering Yang, really well done. Also, Yang's bear pun, I'm sorry, well deserved punch. And this final part of Yang using her semblance and just creating a soul of fire was beautiful. But her strength really showed when she punches the bear up high, grabs him, and then throws his big bear into the ground and just starts key blasting the fur off of him. I almost feel bad. And then she just had to finish him off with the final sucker punch. R.I.P. this man. I think my favorite thing about this animation is the fact that it fits into the canon. That's just the cherry on top. We know that Yang never stopped searching for Raven, evident of the yellow trailer. So this could either be before or after the events of Junior's Club, and I just love that. You know what, as a matter of fact, I'll put it afterwards, considering she says another bar, hinting that she's already been to one. And on a final note, huge shout out to Android 2124. Your voice acting for Yang was just incredible. And thank you all so much for watching. Please go check out Alex's work. It's incredible. And I hope to see you all soon.